Hello, this is Tova Bergsten, an MD PhD student at the University of Illinois at Chicago College of Medicine. This video is part of our Survivors Advising Scientists educational program, a bi-directional educational platform meant to connect our communities and increase scientific literacy and engagement. Our goal is to bring everyone to the table for scientific discussions related to cancer science and therapies. This is video number seven, Cancer Neoplasia. Neoplasia is an unregulated multiplication of cells. A simplified way to think of neoplasia is almost like the transition between a normal healthy cell to a cancerous cell. This video will cover that transition process. Normal tissues have several layers. In case you come across them, they include epithelial cells, basement membranes, which separate epithelial cells from the tissue underneath, and blood vessels or lymphatic vessels. The contents of these layers should remain organized and only in their layer. Here, the flowers in the garden plot represent organized epithelial cells growing neatly. The fence around the plot represents the basement membrane or the border keeping the flowers where they belong. Dysplasia is the first step in this process when cells lose their normal organized manner of growth. You can think of this as our flowers or epithelial cells remaining in their garden plot, but no longer growing in neat lines or layers. Pre-invasive carcinoma or carcinoma in situ is the next step. Carcinoma means a cancer of the epithelium. This is when epithelial cells have grown in a disorganized way that takes up the entire layer. Here, you can imagine this as our flowers or epithelial cells remaining in their plot but growing messily and so much that they fill up the garden. Invasive carcinoma is next, when cells invade the bottom border layer or basement membrane. This allows cancer cells to enter nearby structures like blood vessels or lymphatic vessels. You can think of this as our flowers or epithelial cells beginning to grow outside of the fence of their garden plot or basement membrane. Metastatic carcinoma is the last step. This is where cancer cells spread to different organs by traveling through blood or lymphatic vessels, which allows cancer cells to grow in other parts of the body. Here, you can think of this as our flowers, not only crossing their borders, but beginning to grow in the garden next door as well. Thank you for viewing video number seven. We'd also like to thank all those involved in the creation of these videos, including the University of Illinois Cancer Center and its patient brigade for providing feedback and shaping the direction of these modules. We'd invite you to reach out to us if you have any questions or feedback you'd like to share. Thanks again.